I made a video on Mausant a while ago. A lot of people were having problems even after I showed you the steps how to fix it. In this video, I will install it using Docker Container. For me, it's already pre-installed, and I will leave the link in description for you on how to install it on your system. Once you have Docker set up, then you can follow along with me. First, you need to clone the repo on your system. Once you change your directory into Mosint, you can see there is a Docker file as well. Now let's build the Docker image with the following command. Let me explain this command in case you are wondering. Now as you know, Docker is a CLI tool, and build is the subcommand of Docker CLI, used to build Docker images from Dockerfile. Dash T option specifies the name, and optionally a tag for the image being built. In this case, dash T Mosint means that the built image will be tagged with the name Mosint. Tags are used to identify different versions or variants of an image. If no tag is specified, Docker will default to using the latest tag. And as mentioned, Mosint is the name tag of the image being built. Finally, the dot at the end specifies the path to the directory containing the Docker file and any other files needed during the build process. In this case, the dot refers to the current directory, meaning that the Docker file is located in the current directory. This process will take some time, so you need to wait for it. Once it's done, you are good to go. Now let's run the tool. And let me tell you the other options in this command as well, what it mean. Dash I option stands for interactive mode which mean you can interact with the container's shell. The dash T allocates the pseudo TTY for the container, which enables you to see the command prompt and interact with the container's shell. Dash dash RM instructs the docker to remove the container automatically after it exits. As you can see, our Mosint is working fine. Let's test it now. That's it for today. I hope you enjoyed and learned something valuable. If you did, I'd appreciate a thumbs up and a follow. Thanks.